I'm Haley from HaleyStory.com and today we're at Bennett's Orchard in Ottawa Lake, Michigan. This is only 15 minutes away from Toledo and today we're celebrating Harvest Day. They have hay rides, apple cider, and of course, donuts. How delicious. Let's go check everything out. All these little babies, oh my goodness. I love this fat one. Like Charlie Brown would be proud of this. This is just fantastic. This orchard was purchased in 1958. The first harvest was in 1959. Five generations later, here we are at Bennett's Orchard. I feel like I look like an apple. Or about as red. It's from the sun or from my shirt, I don't know. This is gonna taste good. My horse and carriage awaits! It's kind of far away. Hopefully they'll be back. They probably won't. I'll have to walk this on foot. Not only does Bennett's Orchard harvest their own apples, but they produce hard cider right here. Let's go take a taste inside. So the Broken Barrel Hard Cider is made right here at Bennett's Orchard from the 1874 Vintage Cider Press. My great-grandmother, which started this orchard in 55, she was taking her apples up to Monroe, getting them pressed. The uh, couple that owned that farm passed away. So when we started ramping things up here at the orchard, we were like, let's go buy that press. So we did. We load the apples in the top of that little stainless chamber is a big grinder. And it chops the apples up into lumpy uh, mashed potatoes. It then presses um, with 40 tons of pressure and uh, squeezes the juice out of the apples. And it comes right out of the canvas blankets, keeping all the pulp inside. Wow. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it is. So it's it's a loud it's a loud loud machine when it gets kicked up. It's it shakes the whole building. It's like we couldn't even be talking right now when it's on. Wow. So. If you like Dust Bowl, which is the root of all of their hard ciders, so if you like that, you're gonna like everything on here. I'm ready to get my hard cider on. I don't know about you. Can I have the crisp apple crisp? Sure, can. My personal favorite is crisp apple crisp. It tastes like apple pie. You should try it. This fifth generation orchard has so much family history. In fact, a lot of the pieces you see here are all handmade by the sons of the Bennett's family. We started this building a year and a half, two years ago, and I was I told my mom, I was like, I, I, I can come up, I've been making my own furniture for a couple of years, so I was like, I can come up with some cool ideas, you know? And we had an old hay wagon that was just literally 50, 60 years old, and the bottom was falling out, the tires were flat, and it was, they were just gonna burn it. And I was like, I'm gonna take the sides of that hay wagon, and I this idea of this, this American flag. My brother Corey made these, uh, turned those on a lathe. He made every little piece on top, the, the metal pieces, the peach, the, the cranberry, the apples. Instead of bend, bending the metal around just to make a little handle. <laughs> And the table, this thing right behind you, I just finished a couple weeks ago. Again, I had some really, really big timbers actually sitting out back uh, in the orchard. Me and my brother collaborated and made both of these, these little hanging chandeliers out of uh, beams of wood that we got from my brother Chris's barn. So we diced those up, we did all the metal work. Corey, Corey hung those, uh, the cords and the, he handmade the, uh, the little uh, sockets that hold the light bulbs. Oh wow! So okay. for that one, and we did the chains. This and fifth generation farm is full of family heritage, from the first tree that was planted in 1958 until now. The family is so involved. Sons with their wives and all of the grandchildren come and enjoy this beautiful orchard, full of family history. I'm Haley from HaleyStory.com and you should come to Bennett's. They're open until December and you can get pumpkins now and Christmas trees later. I'll see you next time at Haley Story. Is the, the big family affair and if you have a big family and everybody is willing to be a part or willing to chip in or do what they can, we provide from July to the end of the year 
uh, you know, every vegetable under the sun, then, you know, fruits, uh, you know, apples and peaches and ciders and hard ciders, and, you know, now you're in the fall, you got donuts and pie. <laughs> <laughs> That's Bennett's Orchard. Yeah, Bennett's Orchard. <laughs>